Okay, guys. I'm starting off this episode a little different because I have a very important question for you. I am very concerned. What now? What is? Okay. Father, throw your axe at those trees on the other side of the bridge, the ones with the white trunks. Well, I had a very important question. <laughs> you dummy. Okay. Okay. No. All right. We can chill here. Okay. While I ask my question. Okay. Just, just this once, please. Do you guys, no. when you get dressed in the morning? Oh God. Do you? Oh, the white one. Is that what he said? <laughs> yes, the white one. Okay. I just weird tree. That's all I heard. I was so focused on my shit. Do you guys sock sock shoe shoe, or do you sock shoe sock shoe? You must be smart. I don't keep my shoes in my bedroom because I'm not. Crazy. Yeah, so sock sock. I don't know. Sock sock shoo shoo? Yes. Okay. How do you do it? What's okay. yours? How 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 do you how do you do it? I I need Because you wanna you wanna know how I do it in the morning? <laughs> yes. Shirt. Sock sock pants. What? <laughs> what? No. You do that. That's so much worse. What if there's an emergency and you need to leave the house immediately? You're going to look like a clown. You're going to look like a clown wearing your shirt with your dick hanging out. <laughs> Even worse than that, you never said you put on underwear. Oh, <laughs> police. Does Derek not wear underwear? Derek go commando? Do you really think I go commando? I, I know don't people know who anymore, do. Derek. So you apparently put you? your socks on before right. you put on your pants. I 100% know people who just don't wear underwear. Oh boy. But that wouldn't be weird to me if so you. So I, I have a blatant fear of my uh, my bits getting caught in the zipper. So mm. no. no you oh, just be God, extra careful right. about that. Also, jeans are just uncomfortable. Yeah. That was our brand. Like, my that just sounds uncomfortable. Yeah, there's a lot of grind going on in there that yeah. I wouldn't want. Right. Look, you want I should upgrade or Would you not? consider Would you Very consider well. no underwear and basketball Expecting shorts poop. commando? Like like these shorts here? Or is this technically like a pajama? Basketball shorts? Or yeah. like those or shorts the specifically? The oh but these are basketball shorts. I almost count but those I as like boxer briefs. Do you kinda? Yeah. I mean they are they are Let's three inches away. lower than yeah, my boxer there, briefs. There is Either boxer briefs or just pure boxers. That's mostly what some basketball <laughs> shorts are. I see. It's what they feel like. I mean, I still wear underwear with them. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, oh man, we get to my uh, my questions will be answered. <gasps> okay, so it is red stuff. That, yeah. that that red material that we keep picking up. This is for. Ooh, God of Valor. But why does everything around it get worse? Oh. Except for my one luck. Yeah. Is it me or does it say Cod of War? It does it say, does Cod, say of War. Cod of War. Huh. Is it made of fish? Is yes. it. Is it. <laughs> Call of Duty War Tunic? <laughs> <laughs> Stop. Is, was there something we didn't know about? Oh, you know what? I'm wearing runes. Oh. This one doesn't have runes on it. So I wonder what it would be without the runes. Okay, well, waste armor. Let's see if that's worth it. Everything I have has runes, though. It's just not worth it, I don't think. It be, shorty? I, like I don't have enough silver, shorty. either. I don't have enough hack silver. I have no. enough, uh... I have enough scap slag. Basic fighter, basic fighter. So can I rebuild... Can I remake this? Would it even oh, be worth it? Make up your mind? Hold on. Okay, we'll go back to me. Am I intended to start over with whatever this is down here? No, I'm clearly not. Because that's way less than what I'm wearing right now. Way less. Okay, well, let's oh. do... Uh... <laughs> it is a callback to Call of Duty. What? Really? Well, hold on. No, I'm misreading. Okay. Okay. I'm dumb. <laughs> yes. The armor set is to, is a callback from the Card of War bonus costume from God of War 2. Huh. Alright, man. And apparently it's rarity perfect. 
Perfect. I didn't realize that was a rarity. Yeah. Up the strength, up the luck, up the cooldown. Heck yeah. yeah. So, Jack, the reason why you never saw that armor set is because that armor set is purely for New Game Plus. Okay. Yeah, it totally explains why I don't have it. Is it better? Mm -mm. Um, it's just a perfect set of armor. Each piece of armor has three enchant enchantment sockets. Its skills are big splash. Using a hellstone or rage stone creates a powerful explosion that inflicts frost and burn damage to all nearby enemies. Sea change. If Kratos' health bar is full, using health stones will grant rage instead. If Kratos' rage bar is full, using rage stones will grant health instead. Uh, Cry Haddock. Using a health stone or rage stone grants a protective barrier, preventing damage from enemy attacks. So that's what it does. Okay. Well, don't look now, but our friends who were hiding in the trees are back for more. Go okay. On, give that action oh. swirl. It's a callback to this costume. <laughs> Let's see. The costume is a literal cod. James, put it on the screen. It's it's a fish costume. I I can't. Put it up. I can't make you look at it. <laughs> I'm not going to do that to our poor viewers. It's amazing. Please. God, I'm sorry. I just can't do it. Yeah, apparently, they say the best armor in God of War is the mist armor. Okay, that's what I'm wearing right now. Oh, okay. No, no, it's not. No, you were not Yeah, yeah. Uh, so, the mist is... The mist is weird. The mist is like a time trial where you have to kill to get health, but the mist is constantly killing you. Should put you in the right direction, huh. sure. See, you huh. boys ran afoul of some travelers. I don't think I would like that. Well, them travelers ran afoul of you more like. It's really, it's really weird, and it's hard. I remember not doing it. I remember I did it a little. So, that armor, it leeches your health, you said, right? Not the armor, the mist. Oh, the mist. Yeah, the mist itself. Because okay. I think I'm wearing, I'm wearing something of mist. Yeah, I have I have the chest. The, my chest plate is mist, but oh, why well, am wearing the mist armor? Did I do it? Am I the best? Huh. All right, I'm wearing the mist armor. Go me. <laughs> All right. Well, I do remember it being hard too. So. Hooray. Hey, bro. You found something Cause, interesting. Um, you the armor that hurts you now. remind me you know of a the of Dark Lord the of the of Sith us. that oh, yeah. his armor that, is that made out is. of like. It wasn't easy to kill. Oh, no, really? Oh. Giant monster made out of uh, They're similar to easy. horseshoe crabs, like space Jocker. horseshoe crabs, okay. that are lightsaber resistant. Nice. But um, it inflicts pain on you, like constantly. Oh. Okay. But the thing is with. Brock. The Sith is that you when you're in pain, you become more powerful. Why? work in relationship Why? with that bootlicker no more. That's just what I wasn't they do. about okay. to let him use sure. it without it's me, and he hate, likewise. It's hate, anger, suffering, pain. All that stuff gives you strength as a Sith. Okay. I guess it was the last thing we saw eye to eye on. I mean, that's why Darth Maul was what? able to survive. You want a hug? Being cut it's in half with pure Hi. hatred towards towards Obi Wan. Probably a little bit of pain in there. Oh well, yeah, there's pain, but very much hatred. Okay. You can almost will yourself alive with hatred. You left me to fight alone. I did. Did he? People are one thing. Everything else you fight. Until I say stop or we are dead. Understand? Go your way and we go home. Good then. I said open! Yeah. Uh. Okay. <laughs> what? Those doors uh, reminded me of uh, sometimes when you have your followers in Skyrim and they would oh, trigger the traps. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> And then kill you. <laughs> You're like, why? Like, if I get around it first, you get around it as well, please. Yeah. Um, I guess Mass Effect companions were a little janky, especially in the early ones with the squad controls. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah. yeah. And how it didn't have like a true cover system yet. Wait it, it really was almost easier to like just leave them somewhere, you know? Whoa. I would just I would just tell him to cover once and then flank and that's pretty much how I beat the game. Jack, don't die. I'm not gonna die. Really? Hey, Jack. Oh. <laughs> I didn't think it would jump at the last second. I thought I had I thought I had like another second or two. I didn't think it would just give up. <laughs> I remember doing that my first time through here. Last time I checked, you had your blades that you could just I don't know use. Well, yeah, I thought I just had a second, you know, Jesus. Stay. Wait there. Okay. Take two. Oh my no. god. No! No, 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 no. <laughs> no, use, use. Okay, fine. Fine. You're doing great. There we go, we're doing it. I like how your kid tells you to watch out as the fire bear in the face. <laughs> Spider-Man reflexes. Sporting sense. Yeah. Maybe he's just being sarcastic for all I know. I can't do that crap. He'd come back at me like, hey, careful that it's hot. <laughs> Thanks! I already burned myself. I don't know who taught you this line of humor, but it wasn't me. <laughs> Alright, it probably was me. I blame the internet. No, I blame Jack. Oh, man. Okay. James. Yeah. Would you rather... No. If you had to, of no. course. Would you rather? Uh, uh, 24-7. Itchy butthole. Okay. No matter what. All itch all the time. Okay. Or, every time somebody spoke to you or you spoke to someone else, the first thing out of their mouth was a just direct and deep cutting insult to you. How itchy of a butthole are we talking? Funny, I asked the same question. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'd go with insult. That's just my normal conversations with Derek, so yeah. At some point it just I I wouldn't care. I yeah, I feel like I I feel like I would get used to it. That that's kinda how I feel about the insults as well. No boy. Is I feel like I would eventually uh come to a point where it just I don't know, it probably wouldn't bother me anymore. I'm also pretty comfortable with the idea that I'm a flawed person. That I'd be able to just take the insults. Uh, I think where it would hurt the most would probably be parents and my child. Would probably, would probably be where I think the insults would cut the most deep. Yeah, you know? it's like, ow! Right? Because I, I'm the, I mean, we're talking about like super sensitive soul cutting insults, James. Yeah, because, like, my mom calls me an asshole all the time. I mean... Right. We're, 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 we're talking like they're getting creative with it. Trust I will not let us die. I mean, they're really cutting in there. They're like, what? <laughs> What's up, you empty wallet having broke-ass bitch? <laughs> oh, wait. I don't think you're supposed Shh. to do that. Oh, Shit. We're back here. Friends. <laughs> nice. Good job, boy. Yeah, like that. Yeah, I think where it would bite me in the ass the most would be... Uh, I have taught my child, and I am currently teaching him as it goes. And this has already been a problem once before, I would like to say. Okay. <laughs> I have already taught him that while you're at school... If you punch some kid, God, I can't this back way. you up. That's okay. on you. But if I get a phone call from your teacher because you called some kid a six-piece chicken make nobody, I can back you up. Okay. I got you on that. Yeah, that's fine. Why? Because words cut deep, but punches only cut a little. <laughs> what? Dude, like... Words cut deep, man. You can get a kid with some words. Hey, okay. You know, just get creative with it. There was. A... I think that is where it would bite me, bite me in the ass the most is training my child to be a silver tongue. There was there was a fatherly thing I read on the internet 
where every time his son got mad, he told him to put a nail in the fence. Okay. And so every time he got mad, he did that. And eventually he filled up the entire fence with nails. And then he's, his son was like, okay, so now what do I do when I get angry? He's like, so every time you get angry, pull out each one of those nails individually. And it would just make me more angry. <laughs> like just a constant like just pulling out nails and anger. Yeah. But um he then when he got rid of all the nails up there for the he taught him that I have to wait if you do something out of anger it'll thank you scars thank you. because it has all those nail holes on the fence. Okay. Even though you may have said sorry, it's still there. Sure. I don't know. I thought it was neat. Makes sense to me. Here's Jack completely ignoring my story. Shut the fuck up, you six-piece chicken make nobody. <laughs> See, here's the problem with you insulting me. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, it's, we're beyond it. Come at me, bro. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't take anything you give me seriously. Even if it's serious. So, I also don't know if this is the best parenting move. Um... But it's another thing that has been proven to be an issue already. Wow. Is, uh... Never been this close to the mountain before. I, I don't do the little Looks white so lie thing with my kid. Okay. Yeah. Uh, like... Mom was here to see us. Like, he knows where babies come from. Right. He's awfully young, arguably, to know that. Sure. But the problem that I'm having is that he's telling other kids. <laughs> and the other parents aren't happy about that. I am definitely the least... Oh, boy. The least liked liked parent <laughs> of the PTA meetings, so to speak. Um, Santa was a big one. Uh, I wasn't gonna let Santa have it. I bought those for you because I love you. <laughs> and you know, screw it. I don't. I don't need some other kid being like, you know, why doesn't Santa get me an Xbox? Well, Santa doesn't love you. <laughs> you know. Yeah, so or, I, I told my kid the whole Santa bit, and I guess he went to school and, like, told the other kids, and the teacher was like, you need to let them have their magic. You hey, need me to let their parents lie what to them? Is this is public oh, school. That's not my problem. <laughs> their room's ridden along the side. I don't know if that's the best parenting move, but it's working so far. Well, I feel like they could be butthurt if they want, but... Do you want me to read these rooms? <sighs> You know how hard it is to tell your kid what to stay quiet? As we are, like, so anything I tell you here, it doesn't go out of these doors. That does really work. Yeah, it works for a little bit, but eventually they cave. Yeah, because guess what? We're human beings. We're very social creatures. Right. Very prone to mistakes. Yeah. Oh well, man, I make mistakes all the time. The I can make hell one are you here. Doing? Right? I don't know. He's been. Oh, we were going through a. He was trying to explain something to me so I can oh. progress. I have to do that bit. Man, you got like real lost earlier for some reason. Just like when he's driving. The rings are turning. Come back down. No. Make me. Go! Better be. Nope, 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 nope. Ooh, got him. Got he. Got him. Got he. Oh, okay. There we go. I see rooms. Hooray. Boy, what do those Boy. rooms say? Oh, it says family. I like that he can't read them. It's not a clue. It's the answer. Yeah, uh, like I've never bothered to learn. Yeah, but his right? mom taught him how to read. To trace the uh -huh. into the sand. Oh, it's also a dead language. It's like the language of giants. Ah, uh, it's not like Asgardian or whatever. Something happened. Yeah, out of it, man. Santa, not a thing. Easter Bunny, not a thing. You name it. Yeah, I haven't had that discussion with Cat. Like, how long are you going to let that go for? Behind us now. Well, I just, if we do anyway. I just... 
I don't know. I get for a lot of people, it's some sort of tradition. It's like a tradition that I never understood anyway. You know? Yeah, people are weird. Uh, like, like the whole family gets together and we have a party. But <sighs> why do we wait for Christmas to do it? Yeah. It needs to be on Christmas. Especially since a lot of it for us is based off religion. And, like, I'll go back to our interesting talks about Japanese folklore demons. Roar. Because they, demon? they make up these Warm folklore maybe? demons sure. to as, like, omens Bro. to yeah, your kids. Hey, stay out of that forest. To keep his skills you know? Don't, don't play in this shit. Yeah, that's how most religions start. <laughs> yeah. Well, there was a, the German thumb sucking demon. He was a guy with a pair with a big pair of scissors that comes and cuts off your thumb. Well, you suck your thumb well, too much. Uh, oh. uh, really? what? Hold on. Jack made an oops somewhere along the way. What'd you do? Oh, uh, like Krampus. Krampus. Yeah, like Krampus. For all the bad kids. Yeah, apparently they take it very seriously in some other uh, European countries. Yeah, like Krampus gets more like people dress up as Camp Krampus more than like Santa. Yeah, and they would take like little old whips and whip people in the middle of the street. <laughs> he deserved it. It's fine. <laughs> what the other one didn't learn? This one's different. This one's Brenna. Somewhere specific, I just can't remember where. They have little glowy spots on their shoulders and whatnot. You can't really, you gotta hit them with the axe there. Yeah. Whoop. Oh, these are my wolves. You have wolves? Well, the, the boy has wolves. I just haven't, uh. Oh. Since always, I just have been tearing okay. through enemies so fast, I haven't needed them. Oh, oh right, more. <laughs> I'm just sitting up there with my fist. Ooh! I got your nose! I got your nose! I got your nose, yes! It's for me! Han, can I have a minute with my loot, please? You needed one chop. Double chop! One more to go! Dual chop! Here. Cross Easy. chop! Ooh. Hey, that's two, two more! Kid. Kid, who taught you to count? Not me. So, I also don't know where to draw the line for, like, movies and video games. Because, on the one hand, you have, like, let's say my parents. <laughs> The, uh, no and killing were, humans. No killing humans. Rugrats. Couldn't watch Rugrats. What? Yep. What does it say? You didn't know that? No. No Rugrats. What? Uh, uh no Johnny Bravo. I, okay, I, I, I kind of get Johnny Bravo. I love Johnny Bravo. Johnny Bravo is great. Yeah. I don't care who you are. Johnny Bravo is dope. Um, shit. It's somewhere dumb, too. I remember this. It's somewhere really dumb. Yeah. Because I have to, like, hit that one and then run up and hit those. I thought it was, like, here, but maybe I have to look through this. Um, no Harry Potter. Did I cover that? No Harry Potter. I knew about that one. Uh, general violence. So, like, no. There it is. Um, it's, like, no aliens. No predator. None of that. I think I could watch Jurassic Park, and I just didn't. I don't honestly remember. And then, on the other hand, I have you guys. Hi. Whose parents could give a shit less. Yeah. Yeah. With I my think parents, I think it was Derek's mostly... parents gave a shit about nudity. So did mine. Like, the, like that was it. Well, but then I'll, I'll take one of the most famous uh, things against like video game violence and nudity. I never was a fan of Grand Theft Auto. 
Me either. I, it was just never my thing. I did, uh, oh, was I supposed to be going here? No. Here, right? I think you are going the right way. I don't feel like I am. Yeah, but it's like, I, I don't understand it. Is it to keep your kids from be being, Boy, being desensitized to things? Head. Because... In a way, I feel like it's a healthy thing to split between what's real life and what's in a video game. There should be a clear understanding of what's what. Yeah. You know? But, like... And, like, with you... Oh, I remember this. Oh, yeah, the piglet. With you not being able to kill people in video games, how is it any different than us tearing through Covenant in Halo? Oh yeah. With blue blood going like everywhere. I do what you said and it looked like right. it bounced off. Was it something about the, the people? Was it something about the humans? I mean what do you think? Because even when we were young we knew it was a game. Yeah. For sure. And I'm sure it was as as I have experienced now. Um I'm sure it was my parents more of those people? Not knowing how the hell to raise a child, and just sort of trying their best. <laughs> Cause like, come on, Cat and I are nerds. Our kids are gonna watch Star Wars. They're gonna watch Lord of the Rings. They're gonna watch Harry Potter. Uh, I let my kid watch Dark Souls. That's... Oh, watch someone play through Dark Souls. There's no way I would have been allowed to watch Dark Souls or play Dark Souls. Oh, yeah, it's yeah. there's it's no like, way. My dad let me play Diablo too. I like when I wasn't much older than Aces. No, like, too. bruh, when Fellowship of the Ring came out, my parents almost let me not watch that. Really? Yeah. Like, I wouldn't let my kid play a game. Have you heard of Agony? No. No, but it sounds. It, is it that one that's not out yet? <gasps> no, it's out. It is. It's that one where you fight through hell, and it's like a which, survival horror. Which time? <laughs> There's a couple of games like that. Yeah. Ooh, this looks fun. Oh, never mind. It is... Never mind. It is not YouTube safe. No. At all. We're not playing <laughs> YouTube. YouTube. No, there, it's... It's creepy and... Yeah. Not YouTube safe. And okay. it's... It messes with yeah. you. It ran In the way that Amnesia is supposed to mess with you. But this is just <laughs> grotesque. Modern. Yeah. They go for shock value. Yeah. I don't know. So, so, and there is, like, absolute grotesque, of course, I won't expose him to. I got it. You yeah. know, like, f like just full-on gore. What was that game? Relax. Uh, Accuracy over God. Why can't I think of the name of yes! it? It was, um, you were, you were, you were playing as a guy. And okay. you're just going through like a normal day, but then you end up like killing everybody. And... Postal. Yeah, postal. Postal. Thank yep. you. Well, Postal 2. Postal 1 was a top down. Yeah. Postal, postal 2 is the one that we played. Yeah. Boy. Like, that was a little much. Yeah, that that's grotesque. Yeah. I mean, you healed with a meth pipe. <laughs> Did you really? Yeah, you don't oh, remember that? Man, I like, don't remember that at all. Where are you? Let's say I had my kid play Doom. I'd say that's grotesque, but not in the. I don't know. I wouldn't draw the line there. You know, like, I'd let him play Doom because it's an awesome game. You know? Not just because it's bloody. I don't know. Is that weird? Maybe when they're a little older, not when they're Ace's age. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, like, what's the cut for Doom? Betrayus! Well, anyway, so where I was going with this whole bit anyway was, uh... At the end of the day, we all turned out fine. Yeah, we're not homicidal maniacs. Yeah, no, no, nobody cares. Yeah, we're all doing. Guess what? A okay. Because guess what? We're playing those games anyway. Yeah, we're <laughs> doing it now. You just delayed the inevitable. We just broke that dude's neck two episodes ago. And that other dude, this episode. Well, he wasn't really a dude. He was like we didn't know he belonged to anyone. Giant. He doesn't. He's my friend. The boy was following my command. Then help fix oh, this. Oh, hi, Freya. Hold here, Freya, please. Right? 
That one's Paul, said he's losing yes. blood. Is it? Yeah, I believe so. This kind in all the realm and shoot him. You needed food? Target practice. Target practice. I'm I'm so so sorry. Sorry. Keep that pressure on. The blame is mine. I should have kept a closer eye. Will he die? I to be fair, we would have eaten it. You. The arrow right? cut a tideway inside him. Find both ends and hold them tightly. Start with the left side. Grab it and hold. Now the right side. Hold it tight. Good. Now pull them together. Line them up. What? So now. Okay, it did it for me. You're a witch. I can't finish the healing here. My home is just beyond the trees there. You will carry him. Yeah, I guess, dude. He must not die. Good. He seems stable and calm for now. Great. I can do that. This way. Sure yeah, you can. don't? It's just Tuesday. Oh, hey, we need him next time. Hey, hey. perfect time.